Now, would you believe that if I could just use this ruler to cut this piece of paper? Well, well, I'll show you. And also, this is double-sided, so let's do. Ready, set. <coughs> Hi, guys, and welcome to a new episode on this channel. Today, we'll be talking about dun dun dun, the 54th idiom. And today's idiom is sink the world of someone. Now, what does that mean, sink the world of someone? Well, the sink the world of someone means to be, well, sink about the mind of someone else. I didn't really hit myself, all right? That's just a fake. Now, the definition means this. I already told you the definition. Now, the origin means like the world is the world is like the mind, mind control, like the mind of someone else with mind games. No, I'm kidding. There are no such things as mind games, even though Hitler tried to use them once. By the way, that that's for a side, another time. Now, now. Let's look at some examples. I already said the uh, origin already. Example number one. She thought about the world of her son. Mm. Example number two. They were too busy worrying about their own world that they never sought the world of everybody else. They became greedy. Example number three. She thought in the world of her mom so greatly. Da. Now let's look at the comic. Mrs. Lee sinks the world of her grandchildren very much. She's always pleased to see them, well, having a visit every time and then. But to the end, she always gets tired. And at the end of her, their visit, she is equally she was equally pleased to, of her grandchildren coming to leave. So yeah. I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did. Please like, share, and subscribe to this video if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next episode. Shin Han out. Peace.